Once upon a time, there lived a pious Brahmin. He used to perform religious rituals. He was one day requested to take part in a magnificent religious ceremony for a wealthy man in another village. The Brahmin accepted the request and went to serve the ceremony. He gave his best and everyone in the ceremony appreciated his job. The rich individual thanked the Brahmin for his service and presented him with a very healthy goat as a token of appreciation. The Brahmin left the man's house after thanking him for the generous gift. He carried the goat on his shoulders because he didn't want it to walk as it was a long way to his village. While walking on his way, a man approached him and asked, You look like a very holy man, but why are you carrying a dog on your shoulders? The Brahmin was appalled. He responded, Are you blind? It's not a dog, it is a goat. Keep on going, old man, but it is obvious that you are carrying a dog, said the man. He decided to ignore the word of the man. He thought the man could have been crazy, so he kept walking ahead. Brahmin walked on further, when another guy approached him and asked, Is it proper for an old and righteous man like you, to carry a dead calf on their shoulders? The Brahmin was surprised why the goat did not look like a goat to others. So, he replied, Young gentleman, this is not a dead calf. It is a very healthy goat. The second man said, Do you think I would waste my precious time to come and ask you, if you were carrying a goat rather than this dead calf? The Brahmin was stunned and left the man. He began to doubt if he was carrying a goat. He even kept the animal on the ground for a few moments to confirm whether it was genuine. It looked like a regular goat to him. How can someone mistake it for a dog or a dead calf, he thought. The Brahmin got confused, but continued to walk further. The perplexed Brahmin had covered a little distance when a third guy came up to him and asked, why would a man carry a donkey on his shoulders? Brahmin had enough already. He now knew something was wrong with what he was carrying. After all, three men couldn't be all crazy and wrong. He dropped the goat to the ground and ran away screaming, It is a ghost. It changes from a goat to a dog to a calf and a donkey. The Brahmin abandoned the goat. Then the three men who approached the Brahmin came together and laughed. It was indeed their plan to confuse and fool the Brahmin into leaving the goat behind so that they could have it. They saw the Brahmin carrying the goat from afar. All of them were lazy and cunning and wanted to cheat him so that they could take away the goat. They discussed the matter amongst themselves and devised a plan to get the goat by befooling the Brahmin. After deciding the plan, they got separated from one another and took different hiding positions at three different places on his way. And the Brahmin was so gullible to leave the goat behind, being deceived by those men. Always think for yourself. That is the key to a successful life. Don't be influenced by what others say, especially if it means rejecting what you believe in. Follow your own intuition and do what feels right, not what others tell you to do. You'll be happier and more fulfilled in the long run. Always have faith in yourself and your instincts. You should always trust your intuition and go with your gut feeling. It may not always be easy, but it will be worth it in the end.